Welcome back to Teacher Reacts. Hi, I'm D-Dog, a teacher. My class I'm playing music videos. I'm sorry, right on my channel. I have so many things to get through, but we're going to go ahead and move along today's recording session with Sujin, who used to be a part of G-Idol. This is a song called Mona Lisa. I am going to keep this intro as quick as possible, mostly because I just want to see what this is. I heard like the first one second of it, and I was like, ooh, this is a lovely song. So I'm just going to go ahead and press play. Mona Lisa, you in my eyes. I love your voice. I love how much that hit me. The immediate, just the immediateness of it. Ooh. I love this beat. I love that it sounds very uh Latin style, Latin, something like that. What pretty makeup is that? I love the sparkles. Show me something nice on this, uh. Okay. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. Because I definitely thought the chorus was going to be whatever we just started out the song with. This is totally different. Good, good harmonies in the background on this. I really enjoyed that part. Ooh, good hide it. I like that the lyrics mention water and stuff and the instrumental doing that little like pluckiness of the stuff makes it feel underwater. We've used that, uh, that type of sound before in a different song. The real question becomes, how much do I like this chorus? Because it's very similar to uh, a male song that I listen to. That is, oh, see this part's fucking great. Huh. I'm gonna make comparisons and I know people are gonna get mad at me, but I don't care. We'll talk more during the second listen through. Breakdown's real good though. Like the little stings of guitar and stuff in this, emphasizing certain parts of the choreography is real good. Is that the end though? Oh man, that was quick as hell. Okay, so let's talk about like, we're gonna talk about a couple of things. Once again, if you've ever watched me before, ever, you know that I don't just put up things I like. I'm going to put up things that I criticize as well. This song has really good parts and one outstandingly not good part that I really don't enjoy. Let's talk about the good parts uh, first. The beginning of this where they basically do that like second half course of the second half of the course is very striking. I love that it hits you very hard. Now, one thing that you know, you know your boy is going to criticize though, is the rep repetition in the course of just doing one sound over and over again. Now look, we're gonna make a comparison here because I criticized a uh, a male artist song for that exact same reason, and that would be Kai's Rover. That song and this song are very, very similar in the course where Kai's Rover just a rover, over, burn, but up, but where this one instead just, wait for it. Like it's just a repeating over and over again. And like, Yes, I'm a person who craves complexity and that's not the most complex thing. But if you took that chorus away, let's just take this A part out of it. The rest of it's very fun. She has a phenomenal voice in these vocals. I just wish she used it in that chorus in a more productive manner. Uh, I think that overall, this song is still pretty good. I could probably get away with playing this in class and kids bobbing their head to it and whatnot because it has a nice beat. Like, and all really most pop songs nowadays just need a nice beat and you can get away with at least a mid song. And this is pretty good. Her voice is phenomenal. She does very fun things in the verses. Like they showcase that part very well. I just wish this part was replaced with the Mona Lisa part that was in the beginning. 
and I think during this part it goes into that. I know at one point it does. Um, and that's just me realizing, hey, they're focusing on the choreography. They're focusing on probably like some type of fucking dance challenge or something like that. But this part right here is great. I like that it drops out all of that instrumental for the most part besides some chords. And it's her just showcasing phenomenal vocals, showcasing good sounds. And honestly, the climaxing on that I am that Mona Lisa and then going into this breakdown, this breakdown's good. We talked about it for a split second, how they have stings of guitars in the background. Let me see if I can, you can hear it right now. And this is a nice little climax of the song. Notice that it's in the end and everything. Kind of wish there was like one more chorus of it, but you can hear it here. Yeah, those little stings of gu a guitar are nice. It's just very, I think I only don't like that chorus of the repetition of the A eh over and over again. And that's just me preferably not liking that specific part. Everything else is great though. I mean, one thing, like I say, I pride myself on my channel is always having your own opinions on things. And I'm going to give you my opinion on why I do and don't like certain songs. This is one of those songs where I enjoy most of it. I just dislike that chorus -y, or not that chorus of the eh, 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 over and over again. Feel like this beginning part would work a lot more than everything else. I don't know why it's freezing up. So we're just going to go ahead and do outro time. If you like this video, click the like button. I'm going to need likes. Anytime I criticize things, those dislike buttons come in and I need likes to help counteract them. Um, subscribe because we're on the road to 2K. We hit 5 1500 recently and then uh the comment yeah comment tell me how you feel on that i know that it's just the type of song that it is but everything outside of that a is really good it's the same thing with rover i like kai's rover i just don't like the chorus at all that's just how i am it's just some repetition stuff it just comes off more annoying than fun okay that's me that's it i'm done i'm gonna go ahead and go to the next song see you all in a couple hours probably goodbye